In order to better facilitate communication between the Baltimore Police Department and our community members who may have behavioral challenges, are non-speaking, or have difficulty communicating their needs, you're being provided with an analog communication tool. The Autism Society of Baltimore Chesapeake has partnered with the Baltimore Police Department to provide you with a user-friendly communication booklet that will help facilitate an effective exchange of needed information with the most reasonable accommodation. In these types of calls for service, it is important to remember to first de-escalate the situation by staying calm. Take a few breaths to decrease your anxiety and avoid personal touch. Minimize extra distractions and decrease surrounding noises. Distractions can be onlookers, lights, sirens, sudden movements or noises, crowd chatter, and radio chatter. Exhibit patience and display a genuine sense of concern and interest in helping the person in crisis. Then, turn to the corresponding page of the information you seek and calmly show it directly to the person you're trying to communicate with. Hi, I'm Officer Costantino. Do you need help today? This is being audio and video recorded. How do you feel? Oh, you feel sad. Do you have a communication device? You don't. Do you have a medical ID bracelet? You don't. Okay, what's your name? D A N. Dan, is that right? Okay, Dan, what's your phone number? Four, one, zero, two, zero, one, three, one, four, five. Is that right, Dan? Okay, Dan, now that we have your phone number, would it be okay if we tried to call someone? Thanks, Dan. If a person in crisis responds yes to having either a communication device or a bracelet, ask them to show me your device or show me your bracelet. Then proceed to acquiring the necessary information you need. 